You want a side by side S95 B's? The new 1420 update is on the left, and the older 1310 update, which was our favorite, on the right. Look at that. Look at the red pop on the left. That's interesting, right? All other settings are identical. So since I've had time to spend, um, well, since I've had more time to spend with the newer update, which I so loudly criticized on the, the 1420 update, I see that they, it actually has some benefits, but they put those benefits to the video, uh, video viewing, you know. So I think what they're just, as I said before, trying to compete with the Sony. And uh, they took a little something away from the gaming. There's no doubt about that. But, you know, that's more comparable to the Sony as well. It seems like they're trying to gear themselves toward that competition. They're taking on the... The A95K is what they're trying to do here. So I can understand that, but I want my gaming capacity to go back to where it was as well. So I have to say I think maybe it's it looks better on the left. What do you think? Look at that. I wonder why. We're going to have to tweak the settings on, on yours somewhat in this mode. Anyhow, I just wanted to say that, you know, it's a beautiful TV. All around, there's no getting around it. Whichever update, I, I remember uh, I've heard a bunch of people uh, giving their opinions about these different updates, and everybody was like, "We should have never changed. We never should have let it to update." But you know, in my opinion, that 1310 update was the best. And if I hadn't let it update from original purchase, it was like 1304 or something. Um, then I would never know that. So. You know, logic dictates that they're not going to destroy it with a uh, with their updates. And if they do mess something up, well, they have the ability to fix it. So if we just if we're just patient while they're going through this process, uh, may, it just might be that this TV is going to get better and better. And then uh, it, when it goes up against the A95K or whatever Sony puts up in 2023, we'll just see how the reviewers think of it then. Maybe maybe that's what's going on here. So. Um, that's how I've come to think about it and I think that people should not make the mistake I made which is panicking when I first saw it because I was angry because my game mode was affected but I game on it every day and it wasn't that badly affected and I wouldn't have even known it had I not had the second S95B right next to it so the game mode seems to have been somewhat negatively affected while the, uh, the video, a lot of the video is improved. So what can I say? You know, I don't have mine calibrated and uh, I, maybe I never will, you know, based upon these updates that would really, it wouldn't be logical to spend money to, to calibrate it. But you can just play with it yourself until you get it where you like it, you know, and uh, yeah, that's what I think about that. I just wanted to let everybody know that there's good things about this update as well. Thanks for listening.